We've got a boy, we've got a girl, and today they're going to clash head to head in the Puberty Trivia Challenge. I hope you studied up and paid attention in sex ed because the winner gets a sexy, sexy prize. Oh, okay. nice. that <laughs> sounds wonderful and a little awkward. Question one, okay. what? Is the typical first sign of puberty in males A. Scrote growth, B. Pubic hair growth, <laughs> C. Voice deepening, or voice. D. EHP, episodic oh. hyperactive penis? I know which one. Episodic hyperactive penis. Okay. Episodic <laughs> hyperactive penis. Um, that sounds I like, like that's something right. I know. <laughs> Scrote okay. growth. That's hilarious. <laughs> Dude, let that be the answer. You just have a giant bubble <laughs> sack. I am a male who went through puberty and I did not hear about letter D. I'm wondering if it is in fact episodic hyperactive <laughs> All right, Raven? B, pubic hair growth. Nick? Episodic hyperactive penis. <laughs> episodic hyperactive <laughs> penis. I put pubic hair growth. Okay. And you are both incorrect. What? You are both incorrect. I put a hyper episodic hyperactive <laughs> penis, dude. That's I said saying. that's a fake term. The correct answer is God. A, scrot growth. <laughs> I thought your balls dropped last. Scrot growth. I <laughs> dude. But isn't your scrot constantly on the... Is it the scrot growth? It's scrot growth. Oh, no. <laughs> what we does this scrot mean, Scrot growth Joe? means that yeah. your testicles and your scrotum start to get bigger. Oh, before you get hair? Mm -hmm. Like, That's so icky. That's so weird. <laughs> <laughs> it's not the only thing that grows, Raven. There's a lot more. What do you mean by that? <laughs> Take it as you will. There's a lot of boy body, and it's all growing. What is the typical first sign of puberty in females? Ooh. Underarm hair, <laughs> B, breast budding, first period, acne, or EHP, episodic hyperactive pagina. <laughs> pagina? <laughs> <laughs> now I'm starting to think okay. of mm. <laughs> What is, what is breast part? budding? <laughs> when so the breasts start, start to bud? Oh, interesting. Reveal! I don't know. C, first period. First period. <laughs> B, breast budding. First period. First Damn. period. Benison? I put acne. Incorrect! What? Damn. Incorrect. Wait, Again. no, I really thought that was it. Both incorrects! Oh. Martina's correct! Yay! Yay! Was, was that a scary, awkward moment for you? Honestly, and I feel like a lot of women can relate to this, I was like, holy moly, there's, I have lumps. I was like, I have lumps, I'm gonna die. Because what they don't tell you is that your boobs are actually gonna have like solid mass as you start to grow, like when you're starting out. Like, like you're actually hard? gonna, yeah, like some, there's like hard portion to it. They don't mm. tell you that. God. Damn, we're, <laughs> yeah. we're not repping so well we're right now. Rep Speaking of breast budding, what is the name of the condition where boys experience breast development during puberty? Is it mastitis, hyperplasia? C, gynecomastia, or D, male chestio and gorgio. Oh, man. oh it's <laughs> that one. <laughs> that sounds like a Harry Potter spell. Male no, no, chestio no. and gorgio! <laughs> male chestio and gorgio! <laughs> Don't laugh at science! I'm gonna use my knowledge uh, of words. I know, I'm trying to like look at the, the prefixes and Hyper? <laughs> Gin. What is that? What, what's coming? Genetics. What? what are you saying right now? He says some two things. Nick with C. I got B. B. I put B hyperplasia. Okay, and? I put mass titis because oh. it has tit in it. <laughs> I put mass mastitis because I know that this is when you're breastfeeding, you can have blockages and it can engorge. And you're both incorrect. <laughs> what? Oh my God. Yeah. If it's A, I'm gonna be pissed. You're both incorrect. Oh my God. It's black oh my <laughs> It is in fact C, gynecomastia. Wow. Damn. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> what we're talking about. Maybe. Also, Fight Club, right? Meatloaf had. Yeah. He had, the... he had massive gynecomastia. <laughs> Be the first person to buzz in and correctly spell pituitary. P E T U E T U A T O R Y. No. P I T. Yes. Pit U. Yes. I. Yes. T A. Yes! R. Yes! Why? That's correct! Wow. <laughs> Do you guys know uh, what the pituitary is and no. why it's so important? Nah, I was thinking of paternity, <laughs> prenups. Well, it's the master gland. It's referred to the master gland because it monitors and regulates many bodily functions through the hormones that it produces. <laughs> it makes your bodies grow. It makes you makes you go from a little little boy, little girl, big boy, big girl. Question five. Which one of these is not 
a made up word for a hormone that is very important in the puberty process of both boys and girls. For toxalin, B, gonadotropin, pubertosin, or labia scrotosin. <laughs> labia scrotosin. They're all using such viable words, you know, like furt and gone and pube and labia. <laughs> what is gone? C, pubertosin. I got B. 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 Come on, I gotta, I gotta get one of these right. <laughs> gonadotropin. 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 <laughs> B, gonadotropin, you're both correct! Oh, oh my god. My. Both of you are correct! Yeah! Carter! Yes! yes. yes. Oh, oh man! Okay. B is correct! Woo. Damn! <laughs> That was my first <laughs> guess, too. The gonadotropins are peptide hormones that regulate ovarian and testicular function and are essential for normal growth, sexual development, and reproduction. Mm -hmm. Love them. Mm -hmm. Need them. This is better than my sex ed class. I'd like you both to just take a moment and thank your gonadotropins. I don't think yeah, responding. I called them twice. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> Went to voicemail. Uh, gonadotropin. <laughs> Ooh. What you got there? Oh. Wait. Um, testicles. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, there was actual inspiration. Why do they look like titties? <laughs> That's really good. <laughs> there you go, teabag. Uh, I mean, what? <laughs> oh my, oh my oh, god. Ow, that makes me hurt. Oh, why? You really Help out me. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. A developing young man goes to bed. He experiences an arousing dream scenario. He wakes up and he discovers he had a sexy uh, nai dream. What dream? Incorrect. What is the scientific name for this experience? <laughs> <laughs> what dream? It's scientific. A oh. It's a correct term, but it's not. The scientific term isn't wet dream. No, it's oh not. That is a term for it, though. Uh, involuntary ejaculation. Ooh. Good terms, incorrect though. Um, ejaculation thought. <laughs> <laughs> Nocturnal nut. Oh. <laughs> oh. Nocturnal emission. Correct. Oh my god. <laughs> Yo. Let's go. That was big brain. No Nocturnal emission. <laughs> Uh, Martine, you're correct. What is it? <laughs> Nocturnal emission. Um, a soldier gets orders and he's gonna go on a... Mission. <laughs> Nocturnal journey. <laughs> no, you said the word and you just gotta put the vowel. Nocturnal eruption. No, eruption, you just said the word. Did I say that? Nocturnal emission. Yes! <laughs> Check out this little guy. Oh my God, this is hilarious. Oh. What you got there? It looks like a rat. <laughs> <laughs> no, not me. <laughs> Oh! There we go. Sure. Wait, <laughs> like spit it out. Here we go. Yeah. <laughs> According to the World Health Organization, at least how many sperm those little guys should be present in one, one in one ejaculate? How many sperm are present? Damn! Mm. I know it's gonna be a big number. God, I feel like it's tons, like colonies, dude. <laughs> Do you know this answer? No. Uh oh. It's the World Health Okay. But I'm curious to see what yours is after you write it and giggle. Uh, Raven, what did you put? One million. One, one million. million sperm. That's way more than I Wait, did you put? Wait, can you give me a Dr. Evil? Can you do one million sperm? One oh. million sperm. <laughs> what is that? Jair, how many sperm are present? One million. One, one, one million <laughs> sperm. In a nut. You just blew Benison's mind. 1K? Yeah, 1,000. 1,000 sperms. Yeah. 50,000 sperms. I got all the sperms. 1,001. Oh. <laughs> oh, God. Damn, just imagine the, the number of times I nut times a million. <laughs> That's why I'm so scared. What did you put, Venison? Oh, 2,000. <laughs> you are both incredibly wrong. It's 40 million. <laughs> Stop <Yes>. it. <laughs> 40 million? <laughs> the correct answer is 40 million. What? <laughs> it can get up to 500 million. 500 million? Wait, half a billion, just like poof. Think about that, you can populate the whole earth. That's insane. Bro. That's why I'd be like, keep that away. That's, that's like, that's 40 million children. universes. <laughs> that's galaxies every time. I'm gonna ask you guys to be very, very careful and please point out the vast deference 
on this poster. So that is a picture of a, uh, a rear end. And uh, this That's is That's the a, first thing you noticed? This is a uh, uterus here. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> These? Wow, I've never seen this. It looks like picture. yellow soda. <laughs> I would like you guys to both point to what you think the vast deference is. Is it this one here? That's what you choose? Yeah. That little tubey thingy? Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna go with the same thing. You're both gonna go two. with long tubey thing? I'm gonna guess like right there. Oh, that's what I was gonna guess. You're talking about that long tubey? Is that what you're pointing at? Or are yeah. You, yeah, yeah, yeah. you pointing yeah. at the thing behind it? No, 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 this thing. Boom, and boom. One of you is correct. Oh, you're both correct! Yeah! You nailed it! And Raven knows your oh, body better than you do, dude. sir! Let's go! Damn it. <laughs> oh. And that person's name is Jair! Congratulations dude, on the point! It. Oh my Ding. goodness. Do you guys, do you know what the vast deference does? Does it carry the sperm to the to the shaft and to spit it out. Yes, pretty yeah. much. They cut that during a vasectomy. Yes, that is the tube that is cut during the vasectomy. You know what? You knew that. Bonus point. Hey! Got it. And now that picture of you holding that picture is on the internet forever. Hell yeah, frame this one. What you got there? Lima bean. <laughs> 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 and that's a pocket. Boy, <laughs> oh, hey. It's a uterus. Oh. What are you holding? Is that a vagina? Incorrect. Oh, it's... Wait, I can't say it. Wait. Is this supposed to be a vagina? Incorrect. Is that supposed to be a uterus? Incorrect. A vagina. Incorrect. A uterus. Incorrect. <laughs> Labia? That's a part of it. A bussy. <laughs> a bussy. <laughs> no. Oh, wow. Vulva. Correct. <laughs> oh, God. Jesus Christ. Vulva. Stop Correct. <laughs> a vulva. Yes, he got it. <laughs> like a selfish, uncaring man, just doesn't understand the female body. When I got wow. taught, it didn't have two smiley faces on it. <laughs> I own I own one of these and I wasn't even wow. <laughs> oh. 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 oh wait, that's funny. Okay, you said nice. that. Yes, I know it does one touch it. Uh for a non-puberty related bonus point, what medical procedure did you just perform? A hysterectomy. Correct, sir! Bonus oh, point! Good work. What you got there? We got our own set of balls. <laughs> hysterectomy. Yes, correct! <laughs> What are the little white guys? Ovaries. Correct! <laughs> Damn it. Boom. Ovum. Incorrect. Ovaries! There you go! Because the ovarian cysts. The ovaries? Correct. <laughs> oh, my bad. <laughs> okay, make that uterus clap, baby. <laughs> oh no! How many eggs does the human female body produce in a lifetime? Remember all those spermies we talked about? All 40 yeah. million of them? They gotta go, they gotta go somewhere. In a lifetime? From birth to death. Uh, I was so off that I I have changed. <laughs> I, I'm going big. You're going, you're going completely the other way. 500. 500, interesting. Yeah, what did you put? 10 million. 10 million! Okay, Ooh. how many does your body produce in a lifetime, Martin? 50,000. I, yeah. I said five million. <laughs> and Raven is correct. No what? way, seriously. Five milli. Who was closer? That's a big, yeah, that's a big difference. The point goes to Benison. Yes. Five, get that point. Is that my first bro. point? It's not your first point. Oh, thank God. Your oh first my. point in a while. You release, I mean, per, per, you release one, one or two, two per month. However, in your lifetime, Four. you will make about two million eggs from birth to death. Your body produces wow, two million. How many of those two million eggs are actually released in a lifetime? Oh, oh God, okay. Wait, so women, they, women die with eggs still? Uh, well, if they don't go through menopause. And when you release an egg, what happens, Jair? You, your count goes down. But what happens to your body? Oh, you have a period. Yeah, you're okay. on a period, right? So, I mean, there you go. Oh, how many eggs am I dropping right now? <laughs> <laughs> so one of you believes Women are capable of 60,000 periods in a lifetime. Oh, 60,000 periods? Of you no, but you can release up to two eggs a period. And you're doing four periods a month. Four periods you a month? Oh, what? You're doing four? Oh, 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 you're doing
No. All right. What'd you put? 300. 300. I said 4,269. Very specific and <laughs> ended with 69. Yeah, no, 10,000. 10,000 eggs. That would equate to 10,000 periods. Oh, no. I put 500,000. <laughs> Four one. All right, Raven's gonna get the point, but she's also gonna be mad at herself because the correct answer is 500. Oh my god. <laughs> it's way less, it's 500. <laughs> it's way less. 500 eggs, 500 eggs. Oh, it's so eggs. hot, I'm taking this off now. <laughs> yeah, it should be less. Yeah, 500, yeah, 500 eggs. 500. Yay, I'm closer. <laughs> okay. uh, uh, 500 was my answer. What the hell is this? I love eggs. Pronounce this word. <laughs> Mm, Menarch. Incorrect. <laughs> Menarch. <laughs> oh, you went the opposite way. Menarche. <laughs> Menarch. No. Menarch. No. <laughs> Menarchy. Yes. Oh, Correct. Oh, Menarchy. Correct. Destroyed it. <laughs> wow. Menarchy. Yes. There you oh. go. Menarchy. 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 Have you guys heard that word before? No. Is that a totally new word? Yeah. For me. Define monarchy. Um. It's when you start menopause. Wait, not menopause. Oh, wait. First period. First period. <laughs> <laughs> We're getting so close. Monarchy is your first period. Correct. You nailed wow. it. Wow. Oh, did I? Whoa. I wouldn't have guessed that in a million years. Your first period. Correct! <laughs> <laughs> Your first period, okay. One of the 40 million little buggers that he released, Michael Phelps their way to one of her 500 eggs that gets released in a lifetime. They Dragon Ball Z fuse together and create a what? Is it A, an embryogoat, B, a goatier, a zygote, a goat natatrope, or a goatsy. There's a lot of gots in here, so yeah, I feel like they might have did that to confuse us. A lot of A, embryogoat. And not right. C, zygote. Martine was correct. Woo! But do you like my drawing? I, it's actually kind of perfect. Thank you. What is the answer? C. And C as well. Oh, you both are correct. Oh. <laughs> Ending on a high note. <laughs> yeah. All right, what did we put, Jair? I hope my thousands of put points. Put an embryo. An embryo. No, oh, I was gonna put that. <laughs> you put I put zygote. <laughs> oh no, oh, Venison, no. you put zygote? What and you that? ended with the correct one. Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> I thought that was wrong for sure. <laughs> yes! The zygote! Yes! That's Girls win! Woo! Oh, Let's go. <laughs> Final scores are in and Martine is the winner. Yeah. Uh, yeah, well, then, Good on you. you, you paid attention. <laughs> you came in, ended it on a high note, but Jair throttled you for the win! <laughs> ah, I tried, I really tried. What do I get? What's so sexy? I said it was a sexy, sexy, awkward puberty prize, so you get to take home a tiny uterus, a little, That's little so sperm, sick. a little testicle, <laughs> an egg, an ovum, or Zygote. Uh, oh my god, no one would know what this is, and obviously if I'm walking around with it, I want everybody to know, so like, Dude, these are the I can't do the spur. Ever. I'm going with the zygote. Uh, take it in. <laughs> take a little good seat. What did you call it? Bill. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> he does. Actually, honestly, between the zygote and the egg, Benny, what are we thinking? I think the zygo 